When the term bread is used in the Bible, it represents all that we require to live, not just food. In the Lord's Prayer, we ask God to give us our daily bread. Once we have set our feet on the path of enlightenment, embracing the spiritual basis for living, the source of everything becomes clear. Jobs, family, inheritance, investments, and any of a hundred other channels are but ways that God employs to provide for our daily bread. And as we have learned, once we begin living on the spiritual basis, relying on infinite God rather than our finite self, when one channel dries up, another opens. God alone our source, the fountainhead supplying all our needs. But now, if we mistakenly place our trust in supply in anything or anyone other than God, we are sure to be left wanting. Again, there are many avenues providing our supply, employers, business. And if times are tough, perhaps the government for a time. But all are simply temporary channels. In all our lives, these channels will alter and change over the course of living. But the headwaters, the true source, remains constant. The great carpenter taught in the Lord's Prayer that God would provide our daily bread and that our daily bread signifies the realization of the presence of God, an actual sense that God exists, not merely in a nominal way, but as a great reality for God, our Father, is the only source. My name is Vincent Lee Jones. You can find my videos on Miracles of Recovery on YouTube, LinkedIn, Facebook, and Vimeo as well at Vincent Lee Jones, and my writings and videos on Blogger, title of the page, Living in Spirit. Have a blessed day.